This man was the number one bank robber of all time. He walked into a bank disguised as a painter. No one knew he was a super thief with an IQ of over 250. He put two flashlights on the counter. These were ultraviolet flashlights. The beams were invisible to the naked eye but they could disable the security cameras. Then some workers in white suits entered the bank. They're Jack's accomplices. They locked the doors and got the attention of the security guard. The guard was about to ask a question when a gun was put to his waist. Then the robber yelled at everyone to get down on the floor. The robbers were organized into groups. First they threw smoke bombs into the crowd to create panic. Then one of them jumped on the counter. With a gun in his hand he took control of all the staff inside. Soon the smoke from the bank spread outside the door. A police officer happened to be passing by. He saw the smoke coming out of the bank and rushed to check the situation. But he found the doors locked. When he called for backup he was suddenly hit in the head with a silver gun. The robbers threatened to kill all the hostages if they came any closer. It turned out there was a real robbery inside the bank. The patrolman immediately went back behind the wall to call for backup and evacuate the neighborhood. Ten minutes later a large contingent of SWAT officers arrived. They immediately blocked off the streets around the bank. In order to monitor the robbers' movements in real time, they even called in the only armored command vehicle in New York. Then Jerry the negotiator arrived on the scene. A large-scale hostage rescue operation began immediately. The first time I've seen someone cheat with his hair. The boy grabbed his hair and strung it out. The curly paper instantly straightened. Seeing everything the boy immediately answered the question quickly. Then he began to shake his head frantically, so as to attract the attention of the invigilator, so that other students could cheat. Lisa took off her earrings which were equipped with microscopes. She took off her microscope earrings and shone a light on her manicure. The answers to the test immediately appeared in front of her eyes. And this cockeyed Mike is even better. He hid the answers to the exams in his clothes in the form of 3D drawings, but his strange behavior still attracted the attention of the invigilator. The invigilator began to scrutinize the desktop. Unbeknownst to him this was a diversionary tactic, seeing that the invigilator has diverted his attention. Jack hurriedly pulled open the camouflaged pencil. All the answers to the exam were instantly visible. However while the students were playing smart they did not know that there was a proctor eight kilometers away. His telescope had a clear view of all the cheating students in the classroom. The next moment he walks into the exam room through the back door. He caught the student cheating on the spot. The other students were shocked. Because of the cheating on this test, the head of the grade decided to change the questions and retake the test. But the students who had many ways of cheating did not panic.